Oh, you're you're talking about the town hall meeting right. that you were going to have with or without Collins. Right, yes. exactly. Okay. So, um, we were going to have that in June, but then another group in our district over in the more western part of the district, the Citizens Against Collins and that group, they had a huge town hall meeting and I understand it was very successful. Not with Collins, because he... Course. But um, but uh, but he uh, but it was and there were about 400 people there. And so oh, I remember you telling us. That that. Jane fire. So it turns out that the group, the C27, which yeah. hasn't been all that active lately, um, uh, it, they they decided that we would try to have it in the fall. And uh, and one of the reasons for that is because students will be here. We need the students. And we have some wonderful relationships with groups on campus. Right. And um, also, quite frankly, the expense would be much less yes. because we will go through one of the student groups. Right. Most right. likely the, the student Democrats that did the health care um, town hall. They were very efficient. I thought it was, a, I thought it was really yes. wonderful. Yes. And I think that we need to do a lot more as far as um, health care uh, goes. And I was telling uh, Ben, and I sent out, if you can, go back and look at the email I sent you um, both two days ago and today. Uh, because in it is a really great short report from 538 uh, Nate Silver um, with his newsletter called Trump Beat. And it comes every week. And I have sent you guys stuff from there. I think that he has the best, he is the best source for uncomplicated, simple, but accurate information. And what he found, what they found, is that. In, a ver in, in the report that Trump's staff did about Obamacare, you know, all the hype that they, the yeah. big argument, the way I understand it, and correct me if I'm wrong, the big argument that the Republicans have is that the markets are so destabilized that Obamacare or the Affordable Care Act is going to implode on itself. And we won't have any health insurance companies in to administer the, the legislation. So this report says that in the in that this the information that Trump's staff gave him says that the that the markets are actually much more stable than they are saying they are. And um, so I'll you know. So this, this was a leaked information thing. Has Trump wouldn't was, want his people to say that. I, I think it was in, in the report. Oh, all right. And the report is it's in black and white. And um, so go back to the email that I sent out. I'm not sure if I sent it today because I did send a reminder today. Yeah. But the and other I one may was have long. sent that link and I think it was today that I sent the link because I wanted you guys to have some really good meaty stuff to yes to have because part of this is, was going to be for health care today so um so uh the when why i've got your attention i guess we'll probably have a rally in august we need to get our numbers up uh so so drag people here how do you get in your email